On Wednesday, a long-running saga at the Ranfontein School was seemingly finally put to rest. The independent fi findings into racial tensions at the Hur School Yen for Lyon recommended disciplinary action against pupils who were involved in fights and bullying back in February, while also calling for the school to adopt diversity programs. So we went back to the gates of that school to get the word on the street from ordinary members of the public regarding what needs to happen to combat racism in schools. Take a look. Yeah, I think our government should take this thing, uh, racism, very serious because I feel like they are taking it for granted and they should try to increase the sentence of racism because I feel like they are feeling us as blacks. I felt as a parent that in order to curb the racism in our schools, we need to, to have the policies that will address racism directly. Our schools are much more more. In South Africa, if I go now to my school, our schools are more. Kai kai, who le kwa? Yeah, in South Africa. generations do not know how to become friends. They see colour difference. In our generations and that we didn't we weren't bothered about colours. Our kids should really be taught from home how to handle other people. Banaba Bulayana because of your racism. Racism is a colour. People need to change colour. Kids must be mixed in so that at least they get used to each other. It doesn't matter if you are white or black, you have to get along. Thank you. Word on the street, it's a popular feature here on It's Topical. It kind of gets the realities on the ground, isn't it? We're going to take a quick break. When we come back, I'm going to tell you more about an interesting study by the Human Science Research Council that deals with the race. Also, our conversation with our digital audience. Next.